Today we're going to do a demo of the RMI or RM Italy, made in Italy, uh, model KLV1000, uh, linear amplifier. Some might have noticed that I already made a video on a model KLV1000P with the P at the end. And the P model does not have a driver tube and it's a high drive and this one is one drive and four with the driver tube and it's a low uh, four watt drive amplifier um, before I fire it up uh, on this one going across you got the um, main power switch right here I find it interesting that it's mounted what I consider kind of upside down with down being on and up being off and it's clearly marked that way and even on my 1000P it's the same thing that down is on and up is off which I find interesting but going across um, that knob there is for the preamp it turns the uh, preamp gain up or down um, it can turn it down minus 10 dB or up to plus 10 dB and preamp on switch uh, normal ready standby switch uh, AM SSB switch this SSB just adds delay to the relay over here you got um, a SWR meter and that's the SWR calibrate or sensitivity uh, um, button or knob mind you sleepy it's late um, we got the direct reflect a meter for the S or switch for the SWR uh, direct is calibrate and reflect its actual SWR read um, and you got two buttons for the um, high low or power and how this works is this amp has three taps uh, on the high voltage transformer for um, high medium and low so there are a total of three uh, different power levels and the way it works with these two switches is if you put the um, high low switch there on low uh, the amp is going to be low power regardless of what the high one and the high two is on when you put the low switch on high then the high one and high two are activated and high one would be medium and high two on and high on would be um, high power or full power for this amplifier uh, going across you got a, uh, the two big ones ac across our standard tune and load cap and over here you got a drive which is the uh, tune for the driver tube it's not it's not a um, power level so you always want to tune that up to maximum um, over here you got a watt meter um, that's actually uh, equivalent to um, any uh, store bought you know fifty dollar watt meter reads actual watts um, this knob here I'm not sure if it's factory or not um, but it controls the fan speed um, if you turn it up the fans pretty loud I guess you can hear that and it be, can be turned down or all the way off with no fan so I kinda keep it at a medium so that knob is for fan, fan speed. Uh, like I said, I don't know if uh, that's factory or somebody added that or not. And we're going to show you the insides of it right quick. Um, that's an interesting uh, little top of the tubes there with the um, plate chokes and everything on a board. Um, I think they did that because you got the fan blowing and that kind of creates uh, somewhat of a wind tunnel to um, keep the tubes cool and you got one transformer uh, with all the um, biases and plate voltage and everything over there you got the um, circuit board mounted high voltage relays and um, key and relay and preamp our um, components are in there and that's the big fan and that's the four output tubes and back there is the one driver tube and key and relay right there um, so that's pretty much the looks of it. Uh, that's a little interlock that cuts the um, power off when you open the top cover. I got that um, uh, wired in reverse so I can um, power it up with the cover open. It's a safety measure that 
I bad pass. And over here is a nice clean Tram Titan 4 that I keep on the bench that I usually use to drive my radios with. One of the light bulbs went out, so I just replaced it with uh, very bright LEDs. And I think it looks kinda, kinda night that, nice that way. It's really uh, lit up. So that's the old trusty uh, Tram Titan 4 going into the RMI uh, Italy KLV 1000 amp. And let's put it on standby. And let's show you what the radio is doing. I'm going to the 20 watt scale here. Audio. Actually, the radio does a little bit more, but I got so much junk in line and watt meters and, and tuners and a preamp and SWR meters. By the time it gets all the way to the watt meter, going into a big dummy load up top. Uh, I guess you can't see it behind that big door meter. There's a 5,000 watt uh, big um, dummy load. But anyway, 20 watt scale, that's all the radio's doing. One to five there on uh, average. And let's turn the amp back on to um, ready. And um, I think I'm ready and all tuned up. And let's gear down. Well, let's get off the 20 watt scale so we don't pin my watt meter. We already got it on high and tuned up. So this is what the amp does. I got it tuned for swing. And with that radio only doing one watt, you know, going into it. I got about a good 150 dead key. Audio. Audio. Talking about uh, 550, 600 on average. Hello, 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 hello. About 720. About 725 um, uh, on a whistle. Still on average, audio, audio, and here we got the uh, watt meter, hello, 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 audio, <whistles> watt meter is uh, doing about the same thing, pretty much, and over here we got the SWR meter, hello, 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 audio, that's on the dummy load, hello, hello, nice little transmit light there the room is lit up really bright so it's not really showing the full effect of that hello 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 audio gonna put it on peak right quick I had to unkey it only got two hands and on peak hello 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 audio audio almost 1100 um, peak Hello, into a dummy load, no false watts or anything. Hello, hello, hello. Audio. Audio. Long winded. Running good. Nice and clean. KLV uh, RMI KLV 1000 with the driver tube. Driven by a Tram Titan 4. Only doing a couple watts into it. Sure, I would do more with more drive, but this is how I like to run my stuff. Low dead key. I swing. Okay, that's going to be it for this uh, KLV 1000. 5, 2, 1 drive and 4 linear amplifier. Bye.